We're about to go out to the <laughs> to the parks. Bow 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 bow. Oh my god! Hey guys, it's Vash. Welcome back to Metal Gear Solid 2, the dub edition, the sequel. You know, the second game, number two, numero dos. Uh, it's 12:30 in the morning. It's not 4 a.m. yet. Not yet. The the nights are still young inski. Um. We got to defuse the bomb again. Remember we defused the bomb and then we saved? So it didn't work. So we got to do it again. So we got to take out these two guards again. But I hope you guys are all doing wonderful and amazing. I'm doing all right, I guess. I'm alive. Cool. Yeah. So let's play the game. You guys down? You ready? Let's play the game. Pause menu. What do we have in the pause menu? Not a damn thing. Audio? Why is audio? Why is that in all caps? And resume game? Resume game! Ah! All right. How have you guys been? Good, I hope. Dog, I don't know what I'm doing. All right. Let's uh get these two. That means we didn't get their dog tags yet, huh? Oh, well, we managed to be dooby like that, don't it? Please, no. Please don't. Give me your nipples. Oh, I guess I did get their dog tags. It didn't shake out. I'm gonna, let's get this guy and see. Freeze! No! Don't kill me! Don't kill me! Drop it. So it did count. That's so weird. It's weird how like I find that weird in general in games when like certain things save but certain things don't. Like the dog tag save, but us defusing the bomb and them still being the, among the living is not a thing. I feel like this is too loud. Is this loud for you? You can tell. Right in here. The C4 wild. reported on the roof of Strut E has been taken care of. Explosives were planted on the Harrier 2 stationed on the roof. Good work. Only one more left to go. This is Pliskin. Do you read me, Pete? I'm here. What's up? Ryden, you need to hear this too. I'm listening. I checked Get out the radio. bottom of Strut H for you, Pete. Wait, what's this about? I asked Pliskin to look around. Knowing fat man, I can't shake the feeling like that all the bombs so far were just delicious wrong. Lips. So did you find anything? Yeah, a hell of a lot of C4s packed into the bottom of the strut. Pete called it right. I knew he had the real thing up his sleeve. So all the other ones were dummies? No, they were a threat all right. But the detonation wouldn't be enough to destroy the entire shell. But the C4s Pliskin found would inflict serious structural damage. That's not the bad news either. These are sensor proof. What? New model, I guess. The ionization sensor can't detect them. The whole thing is sealed tight to prevent vapor leak, and there's no trace of that cologne signature. Pete, looks like he fooled you. Yes. But you managed to find the thing anyway. It was sheer luck. Bombs that are invisible to the sensor? Any ideas, Pete? Are there more out there? I'll go see for myself. You can't move fast enough. He's right. I can try the spray from a distance. Hold on. There's something not right about this one. I can feel it. Well, Pete, should I come back and get you? No, there's no need. Ryden, you have one left to go, correct? Right, except for those scentless ones. How about you, Pliskin? I have two left, not counting this one. Okay. It'll have to be me. I have the level four card that'll get me into Shell 2 in any case. You'll never make it. With that bad leg of yours, they'll spot you for sure. That won't happen. I... I can walk just fine. I can even run. Uh, what do you mean? That bomb, five years ago. I messed up. Even with all my experience, I lost it. And a church was lost in the explosion. All those kids playing nearby, too. These past five years, I've lived a lie. Lied? Yes, lied. I didn't lose my leg in the explosion. Uh, so many dead. All because of my mistake. All I could think about was hiding from the crime, shielding myself from the public outcry. I wanted people to be sorry for me, for my weakness. <sighs> I faked being a victim myself because I couldn't bear to face the families of the real victims. This is no prosthetic. I can keep my footing on catwalks and hike over deserts. I lived my life so well I haven't even answered to myself for my sins. It was supposed to be a shield has become a shroud instead. I've killed my soul by playing the victim. 
Instead of protecting me, it's made my life even more hellish. What good can that do the victims? I know. I'm a coward. Hey, Pete. God forgive me. I can walk with my own two feet, and I need them to stop Fat Man. His crimes are also mine. One of omission and arrogance. No one should teach the skills I taught him without a clear conscience. This is the only way I can defuse my own sins. I get you, Pete. That one's all yours. You got it, Raiden? I understand. Pete, I've taken care of guards in struts G and H of Shell 2. I wouldn't recommend you go into any of the other struts. I owe you one. I'll get back to freezing the baby bombs, then. You do that too, Raiden. I'm on it. I'll have the radio with me if you need to get in touch. Just don't ask for peg leg, Peter. He's gone for good. Damn, we taking care of baby bombs? So what I'm doing doesn't matter? This is baby work? You fat fibber? That guy's a huge fibber. What a fibber. Can you believe that shit? He was lying the whole damn time. I know, I think we watched that cutscene last uh, video, didn't we? It's fine, you can get a refresher. Why not? You like you got shit else to do, that's why you're here, right? <laughs> I know I don't. <laughs> I don't have shit to do. <laughs> Welcome to the club. I should have got his, uh, his, uh, dog tags. Like it matters, whatever. What y'all been doing? Y'all been chilling? Yo, when is Metal Slug Tactics coming out? Is the key word never? Before, like, am I gonna fucking be still alive by the time that shit comes out? God damn. It ain't never coming out. Where are we going? Oh, we gotta go up. Damn it. We gotta go over there. Fat man. I gotta juke this dude out. I don't just crawl. Fuck it. You shouldn't be able to see me, right? We're about to find out. Oh, look at that goaded. Goaded. And he fell asleep. Big yawns? Big yawns? The D's nuts connecting bridge? <laughs> That's funny. Ooh, nice shot. No nice shot? No high fives around? Come on, dude. That shot was epic. It was godlike. Come on. Come on, man. Give me a high five. I think we should go under, because I think the bomb is in the bottom left. I think it'll be a better idea to hit it from the hit it from the bottom. Hit it on the low. Oh fuck yeah, dude. Look and we got this too. Hell yeah. Doom. Doom, doom. Boy, do I like this game, man. I this ooh, my favorite. I didn't when I was a kid, I didn't really like Metal Gear Solid 3. Uh because, you know, I didn't watch cutscenes, so I didn't know how good the story was. Uh I just liked uh That's away on the other side, isn't it? Um one thing I liked about Metal Gear was like the technology and like the different cool shit you can use, you know? Mm -hmm. And, uh, well, I need to get rid of this dude. I miss! This is bad. What's that? Hmm. I'm about to choke his ass out. This will teach you to be nosy. You shouldn't have been nosy. Should mind your own fucking business. Please don't. Damn it. Mind your business. Alright, what was I saying? Is this it? Why he keep calling me? I was down here. What was I talking about before I had to get hella sweaty? Because I didn't want to get caught. Oh yeah, Metal Gear Solid 3. So yeah, I didn't like that game when I was a kid. Uh, because I didn't I didn't know how good the story was because I didn't watch any of the cutscenes. Um I'll tell you about it after they call I have the last C4 frozen. There's nothing showing up on the sensor now. Good work, Raiden. You're way ahead of me, kid. I still have one to go. How's your bomb, Peter? It's a bomb, all right. Sealed C4, and in huge quantities. You think there's another one in Shell 1? For sure. Somewhere at the bottom of Strut A. Why are you so certain? If this bottom section of the Strut is demolished, Shell 2 will be well on its way to destruction. You mean that Shell 2 will actually sink? Not immediately. There'll still be five Struts left. But if Shell 1 loses a Strut at the same time, it'll be a very different story. 
The big shell's structural integrity depends on a very exact balance. If both shells lose a strut each, the whole structure will tear itself apart under its own weight. What do we do? I have a sensor that can locate even those scentless C4s. It makes combined use of a neutron scintillator and a hydrogen bomb detector. You brought that stuff with you? Of course. I made the calibrations while I was in the pantry. Does it work? I just tested it, and it definitely responds. But the best I can do is a sound beacon, not the radar. Sound? The shorter the interval between beacons, the closer the target. I get you. There's another one in that pantry I was in. You can go back and get it. It's all yours, right? Me? I'm going to study it some more and see if the freezing process will work. Don't touch the other one until I say so. Okay. I'll stand by until you radio in. You make Snake's punk ass go do it. I don't remember where the fuck it's at. Where do we need to go? Oh, we gotta go that way? Shit. That means I gotta get the fuck out of here. Because they're gonna... Oh. Who's there? Who's there? Who's there? All right, he's gonna wake that guy up. We're about, it's about to be some mess, dude. It's gonna be a mess. It's gonna be a mess. Oh, well. Shut up. Dog, you guys snitching? What are you, a snitch? What are you, a tattletale? Oh, fuck me, dude. Oh, wait, we're, yeah, we're both. Is this door open? At least the music's both. Mind your fucking business! I'm out of here, baby. Going in on them bongos? I'm fucking out! So yeah, back to the Metal Gear Solid 3. Uh, I didn't know how goaded the story was. Uh, because I, I didn't watch any of the cutscenes. You know, like a normal child would? <laughs> uh, it wasn't until I was much older that I experienced how... Uh, Godlike that game's story is. It's really good. It wasn't until much, much later. What? Hold on. How y'all fucking know I'm on this bridge? I swear, if they run through there, yeah, my luck is so bad. They got ESPN. Like, I'm like, I'm about to go through the door and you open it and they're right there. Like, hi. It's fine. We made it. Doom, doom, doom. Yeah. I really dig it when I was a child. Peter, I have sensor B. I Good. think my playthrough of that I did like a. you know How's your invisible 15 bomb? years ago or so. I'm looking at I think that was the first time I've ever distance. actually watched all the cuts in the A few I more get up and go leave I just got to the last strut, but there are a few enemy sentries I have to take care of. Does it look bad, Peter? Maybe. It's an odd one. The detonator hasn't been activated. What? But the sensors are live, which means... This is Pliskin. I've located the last C4. Is that it? I'm about to freeze it. Then... Wait, wait, no! Pliskin! Pliskin! Damn! That was it! What's going on? The detonator just woke up. It's counting down! What happened? The big ones were rigged to be activated when all the baby C4s went offline. Right, the one in Shell 1 should be counting down too. Hurry! What's the remaining time? 400 seconds. What the fuck seconds. does that mean? 400 right. seconds. Move. What is that like? Get to the bottom of strut A now. Eight minutes? I don't know how long is 400 seconds. I don't do all that. Y'all know 400 seconds? Can you do that math real quick? The math is is that we gotta fucking go, dude. So yeah, um, yeah. When I was I was a I was as I call them today. I was I was a boo boo keys gamer. Uh, I, I don't know. If I made that up. You know, like you know how like when somebody can't pay attention, like babies, and they they jingle the boo boo keys in their face, like the keys to keep their attention. That's kind of how it was when I was a little kid. Like uh, I couldn't watch no cutscenes. I was like, I don't want a story. Why would I give a fuck about a story? If I want a story, I'll read a book. That was literally me as a child playing video games. I played video games. I don't watch video games. If I want to watch cutscenes, I'll watch a movie. And I would skip them bitches. That's just kind of how I was. So it wasn't until, like, low-key. I don't think I started. I don't think I... I think I was, like, maybe 19 or 20 when I started actually watching cutscenes in video games. 
Like, I'm dead serious, dude. I'd skip cutscenes. I didn't give a fuck. I would skip cutscenes, and if I couldn't skip it, I would, uh, you know, play my Game Boy or do something else. Eat a bowl of cereal. I did not watch them cutscenes, so... I don't know, maybe I missed out on a lot of really cool stuff when I was a kid. Maybe. Maybe I did, I don't know, maybe I didn't. I mean, yeah, I guess so, maybe. There are still some games I kind of paid attention to. I know this one wasn't one of them. I just didn't, I would have, dude. I was like 14. Listen. Listen carefully. What is it? I fell for it. Fell for you what? You got you? That man has my number. Oh, yeah. A proximity trigger. Microwave. Gotcha. M microwave? With a seven-foot range. It's not a technique I taught him. Neither was that multi-bomb booby trap. Looks like he's far surpassed me as far as explosives technique goes. As for the rest... Pete, get the hell out of there. There's less than 30 seconds left. It's too late. No! I think you Press can make it if you, start, from if you, if you shut up and start running. You can. Pete, right! Keep your distance. Use the spray from as far away as possible. Me? You can do it. I know that. I'm not so sure. But I am. Do it. I know you can. <laughs> Yo, still been, still been blew up. <laughs> oh man, that's not fun. Yeah, it is funny. He, he blew up. He exploded. He went kablooey. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, man. <sighs> I thought it was funny shit. Y'all ready to hear Yell Dead Cell? <laughs> it's like the one song everyone knows and loves in this video game. Okay. Uh, I believe that that boy is right there. Oh, yeah. Colonel, I've neutralized the bomb. Good work, Raiden. It was a great Call loss him. for everyone. Colonel, I have yes, fucked the pooch. Colonel, any damage report on I the explosion? I have paid the piper. It seems that the duct for diverting the contaminated seawater was destroyed, and the central section of Shell 2 is flooding. The explosions ignited the oil slick on the surface. What about the toxins? The chemicals stayed in containment. There's no immediate danger. Is the big shell stable? Shell 1 was unaffected. The price was high. But the threat of the bomb is over for now. What's the next objective? Rescue the president. Get back to the upper level. Roger that. Okay, I guess I'll go back to doing my uh my job. Yeah, and then I don't know. I was uh I used to play like Call of Duty and like Gears of War online and shit like that. And I just like, you know I guess in comparison today, it's like the Fortnite kids and the Apex kids, like you know, those people that are <clears throat> always playing those free-to-play, like, Battle Pass games that, you know, I guess I was kind of like that when I was a kid. Except we didn't, you know, work for anything. Not that what I mean by that. I mean, like, you know, when you when you play those games, you're unlocking stuff with, like, your Battle Pass and shit. Back then, we just kind of played it for fun. We just thought the shit was fun, you know? Video games? Right. Isn't that why we play them? Because it's fun? For our bomb neutralization. What? We didn't really get a anything out of it. has been killed shot in the head they shot one of them on the roof just to make sure we caught it one of our satellites caught it clear as day damn they announced said, they would damn. kill one every hour from now on Man, what are my orders what should i do stay with your mission objective yeah, you? rescue the president what about the other hostages president johnson is your first priority priority my butt they're all in danger jack be reasonable i know what you're feeling but you can't save them all no, not by myself. Are you expecting that Pliskin to come through? Man, why do you say Pliskin Looks like it was like a he slur? His radio off too. Expect that I can't complete Pliskin. this mission by myself. That man was not included in the simulation. He is not a factor in this mission. What do you mean by that, Colonel? Your mission must remain a solo effort. What about the SEALs? No second attempt? They haven't even gotten to planning that. All we can do is wait. In the meantime, you're our only hope. I understand. There's a lot of shit Ryan, that didn't seem like Ryden signed up for. Rescue the huh? president. You can start off by getting to the upper level of Strut A. 
Okay. Okay, Yogi the Bear. Wee boo boo. Sure. Let's go just do what we tell you. Tell you what to do. I forgot to mention that when you get into alert phase, Raiden goes into like his kung fu stance. And I think someone pointed that out um, in the comments not too long ago that when Raiden gets caught and starts playing the bongos and he, he gets in his snake stance like he's about to whoop somebody's ass. Mm, that melon. Ooh, I know them legs. <clears throat> Y'all ready for the jam for Yell Dead Cell? It's like everybody loves that song. Dude. The song's legendary. I can't tell you how happy I am that you were alive after all. I knew this moment would come. Show yourself and finish me, like you finished off my father. What? Otherwise, you'll be the one to die. Oh crap! Wait. Oh, never mind. I'm nasty. Never mind. Forget it. Forget about that. Delete that out of your memory. I never said that. Shut up. What do you mean? What? That's not him. This could be interesting. You've seen the fires of hell, haven't you? Maybe you can give me death. My name is Fortune. Lucky in war and nothing else. And without a death to call my own. Hurry. Kill me, please. Okay. Y'all ready? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Oh shit! Oh, that kind of hurt. It was a wood ride package, man. You work for FedEx, my guy? Shit, that's about to catch on fire. Damn, every spot we can hide in has got fucking barrels? I'm allergic to fire. It hurts. My skin. It makes me break out. Oh, shit. No, I think we're good. Never mind. We're fine. I thought we were fine. Maybe if I just lay here, I'll be okay. Look at her baby health bar. She's got a pretty fat health bar for somebody that's invincible. Right. Fat Man just contacted us directly. Fat Man called us? Yes. Looks like he placed a bomb on the heliport. He specifically asked for you, right? What? He's killed off Peter. Now he's after you. What the fuck did I do? Why didn't he go for Pliskin? I know. Look, this is really not a good time for this. The countdown's already begun, right? Great. How much time do I have left? I'll show you the count. 400 seconds remaining. Oh, this shit again? So he's planning on taking this place out. It looks like he has a different agenda from that of Dead Cell. What about backup? None. There's no time. Which type of explosives is it? He didn't say. What the fuck did he did? Did he tell you? Oh, I got a champagne glass full of jelly beans. Mm -hmm, come stop me. <laughs> I'll take over, Queen. What is it? It seems our friend Fat Man is out of control. He'll actually try to destroy this place? Yes. This could unravel everything we've planned. But why would he do such a thing? Who knows? But he's nothing more than a stereotypical mad bomber now. He's completely lost sight of our ideals. And with it, 
His loyalty to Commander Jackson. All right. I'll take care of the wayward soul. It wasn't him. Unfortunate. I expected more of this one. Real. But he couldn't kill you. You talk a lot of shit for somebody that's invincible. Completely useless. Then he's all mine. That's like Wolverine going like, man, I'm pretty bummed out you couldn't kill me. Nothing can kill me. Oops. Well, that's what you call collateral, huh? Gave his forehead a booty hole. <laughs> damn, damn, what about that? That's what a crack shot. You think he did that on purpose? I'd like to believe he did it on purpose. It's not cool when you say it was an accident. I can go punch her. Think she can dodge that? Are you gone? No. No. That death was meant for me. Why am I the only one who can't die? Alone again? Cheated out of death again? <laughs> How long will you force me to live? How much longer, Dad? You punish me enough. I thought you could give me peace. But you couldn't kill me either. <laughs> Go ahead, pistol whipper. Give her one right back in the head. That'll make her feel alive. Man, that suit is so cool, even though, you know, riding's caked up in it and back, back, you guys baggage. But it's cool, dude. I like it. I'd wear it. Not in public. But... Probably public. I'll do his hot ass no breath. Sorrow, Queen. I died once already. Damn. I can't die twice. So you got two people that are like invincible. I know they explain it in four. I can't really remember though. It's like the nano machines or some shit. Nano machine, son. Keep him alive. Whatever. Who cares? He's cool. And not dead. He's got a permanent anus on his forehead now. Let's go. We got somewhere to be, baby. We don't have time to play with the seagulls on the roof. Man, I was. Oh, shit. When they fuck, they put that there. Which one's this? Explosive detector beeps. AP sensor. Man, fuck it. I'm about to flip over it. Ah! Okay, we're good. Um, dude, when I was a kid and I, like, saved up my money and got me a PS2 because I wanted to play this game, like, my, I think my, like, dad gave me a strategy guide for it. Oh, there's a guy there! Freeze! <laughs> oh, holy shit! Where are we going? Oh. Oh, it'd be faster to go this way. Oh, I'm just gonna go through that one spot. Who's there? Um, what key card do we have? We still have a one, or do we get a two? Oh, I still got a one. Yeah, garbage. Garbage. Uh, who's there? Shit, I forgot what I was telling you guys before I almost ran into that dude that surprisingly had his eyes closed. That's crazy. It took a while for me to notice he was there, too. I was like, wait a minute, what the fuck? What are you doing here? Oh, shit. Freeze. <gasps> There's a guy there, ain't it?
Who's there? Who's there? Oh, we're out, dude. We're we're straight. We're straight. Tr what is this? Straight shrimping? Uh, this is the one when I have to speed run, but I think there's a. Uh, I think there might be uh, mines in the floor, right? Should we just fuck it? Yeah, fuck it. Dude. I don't give a shit. We'll survive. We'll make it. Yeah, look at that. I'm like an expert. I know we picked them up already, but who knows? Somebody could have put them back. All right, where do we go? Up here. Who's there? Who's there? <laughs> Who's there? <laughs> I don't know why I find that so funny. Ah! Ah, <sighs> good old Metal Gear Solid 2. Yeah. I really loved playing these games, man. Boy, do I love to play video games. They are so much fun to play. My favorite. If I shoot that bomb, will it just end it all? Probably, right? I'm not going to try. Who conveniently stuck? Oh, the Harrier's gone. Who stuck this here? Hear them rollerblades? So you're the one. You're right on time, I see. I like a punctual man. Is he dead, Sal? I am Fat Man. I am the greatest that humanity has to offer. Can you hear it? Hear this rhythm? It's the rhythm of time. And life. Don't you know this? I used to hang around department store clock counter. Life is short. Bombs tell the time with every moment of their existence, and nothing else announces its own end with such a fanfare. Glad you could make it. The party's about to start. Is that Kool-Aid? That's Kool-Aid, isn't it? Yum. Oh, that shit just disappeared. Good year. Let's drink the Stillman, shall we? If you destroy the big shell, you'll never collect your ransom. Ransom? What are you talking about? Thirty billion dollars in cash. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what's going on. What the hell are you talking about? <laughs> oh, you'll know soon enough. And I could care less what they planned. My ambitions are much more simple. To be the most famous bomber of them all. You're nuts! No one's gonna give a damn about you! Oh yes, they will. I'll go down in history. As the man who beat Peter Stillman. That's the only reason I assisted them. Like hell you beat Stillman. He had your number. What did you say? You have nothing of his courage. <laughs> or... <laughs> what are you laughing at? That croc died a dishonorable death six months ago. Six months ago. The liquidation of Dead Cell. Call it what you want. Only the right stuff survived that hell. Set me free, you know. Open the way to a new dimension. So that I can become the emperor among detonation devotees. You're nothing but a common criminal, and that's the only way people will ever remember you. How dare you! I'm an artist! That is why I dislike boorish military types. It's time to start the party. This is how it works. I plant a bomb, and it'll explode soon after that. If you prefer to stay in one piece, you'll have to disable my bombs. Laugh and grow fat. Let's move. Let's now move. All right, all right, bitch. Yell Dead Cell? You guys like that song? Because you're going to hear it a lot. <laughs> See him play with the birds. Isn't that cute? Are you just uh, uh, uh. Shut up, bitch! I'm taking my time. I'm enjoying the music. Fuck off. Uh, uh, uh. Oh yeah, you got it. I'm, you're, you're fucking numbers. You're, you're, shut up, bitch! All right, now it's time. Let's play. 
the play, big boy. Where you at? Where you at? Saying you're doing donuts? Fucker. Oh, I got missed twice? My aim's so damn bad. I'm gonna make you a crown out of uh, trinks. Wait, I was about to say, why are you invincible? What the fuck? Now don't you put... Don't you put that bomb there. Uh, let me heal. Man, that boy is scooting. Look at that. That's crazy. What a boss fight. Can I get a round of applause? Clappity clap, clap, clap. Come on, man. I still got it in me. I ain't played this game in like 15 years. Well, I played last. Never, never mind. My suit. Oh, no. I've nothing to wear to the party. Spilling his grenadine over all you. over. That's what you think. What do you mean? What did you just do? What is this? I have beautiful hands. These delicate hands can craft works of art. Answer me, what the hell is this? It's the switch for the biggest bomb of the entire place. What if he just took his mask off and just put, started putting oh, fingers in his mouth? You tell me! No I'm gonna go deeper. Where did you plant it? Where is it? Somewhere in this area. Don't worry, it's very close by. Where is it? Go ahead, shoot me. I'm already dead. Damn! Think you can find it? When it goes off, it'll take the big shell with it. Tell me where I can find the bomb! That's your problem. This is the highlight of the party. Bring it on, I say. They'll be happy, too. I die here and start my legend. Too bad you won't be around to see the movies. Laugh and grow fat. Did I get you? Did I get you? Tell me if I got you. Did I get you? Come here, big boy. Let's see if I can go drop you off this ledge real quick. I got a minute and 30 seconds. <laughs> oh, come on! Come on, you ain't gonna let me drop him? That's fucked up. It's all good. I also have a minute and 18 seconds. So speed bag you! Bow, 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 Alright, let's, uh... That's a lot of bombs. There you go. Good work, Raiden. Looks like all the bombs are neutralized. One of their main leverages is now gone. That leaves. Colonel, Fat Man didn't seem to know about the ransom demands. Intentionally kept in the dark, I'd say. He seemed to be coming from a very different place from the other terrorists. Mm -hmm. Raiden, a lot of hostages, our president included, are still in danger. Keep your mind focused on protecting them. What are my orders? Rescue the president. We have no idea where he is. You haven't been in the central core yet. I suggest you start there. Wait, I have another call. Want me to take it? No, I'll go offline. Best to keep our presence unknown. How you doing, kid? Pliskin, is everything all right? Could be better. Looks like I was out cold for a while. How did you manage to stay alive? Had a little help from a friend. Friend? What about the bomb? Diffused. And Fat Man, too. 
That's good news. How's Shell 2? It's a mess. The bomb crippled H strut. What about the toxins? The what? If the big shell blows up, the explosion is expected to produce massive amounts of toxins. Never heard anything about that. Huh? Well, looks like there's not much danger of that in any case. But the central core is starting to flood. It won't last much longer. Well, what about the president and the other hostages? They weren't in Shell 2. They must be in Shell 1. We need to get the hostages out of here now. It's too far from Manhattan for a swim. What about the lifeboats? There doesn't seem to be any. It doesn't make sense. So a chopper is our only extraction? Right. And it comes with a passenger limit. Intel has it that there are about 30 hostages. It'd take more than a single trip. We'll have to come back. Can you pilot a chopper? No, but I brought a gearhead with me. He's a good guy. I'll introduce you later. Pliskin, I'm on the heliport right now, but I don't see their Harrier. It's out somewhere. We better move now, then. Our chances with a Harrier after us are close to nothing. Do you know where the President is? No, that one's all yours. The President is at the top of our rescue list. These are our orders, Lieutenant J.G. Your orders, not mine. What? See you later. That's fucked up. Mr. J.G. Wentworth. Are these things deactivated enough where I can shoot it? Bow. Oh, hold on. We're about to go out to the to the parks. Bow, 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 bow. Boy, we're going. We're going for the high score with that one. Identify yourself. Unlike you, I have no name. Are you Mr. X? Oh, sloppy second? Missionary? Is that you? But come, let's get out of the open. Follow me. Are you with Foxhound too? Neither enemy nor friend. Just a messenger from the Lali Ludelo. Okay. Or this is safer, I think. You think. Safe from what? Eavesdropping, of course. All right. Why did you contact me? I've been ordered to give you backup. Including the relaying of necessary what? intel. Ordered by whom? Why won't you identify yourself? There is no need for you to know. I'll decide whether I need to know. You are not yet trusted to make such decisions. <sighs> I'll tell you something you do need to know instead. The current location of the president. What? Or rather, the person who knows the current location of the president. Who is it? A secret service agent named Ames. Currently being held with other hostages. Secret Service, huh? The head of the President's security detail, Ames, has been fitted with the same type of VIP nano machine system as the President. If you are within range, you should be able to communicate. Why are you telling me this? Do I need to repeat myself? There's no reason for me to believe any of this. You understand that? Of course, but you also have no choice but to believe. <sighs> Do you have any other leads? Where are those hostages? <laughs> that funny? I forgot the part the where that was funny. Hostages are being held in B1 conference hall in the Shell 1 core. You'll find Ames there. What does he look like? We don't know if it is indeed a he. I've never met this person either. How am I supposed to look for someone without even a description? Use your ears. What's that supposed to mean? Ames has a pacemaker. You'll be able to hear the machine sound in the heartbeat. You expect me to walk up to these hostages and listen to every one of their heartbeats? The sound is too minute to detect and amplify it. You'd be captured immediately. So what am I supposed to do? Use the directional microphone. There's one somewhere in the core. Take this. The security guard will unlock all level 2 security doors, including the one into the core. It's called a PAM card. It works together with your body's own electronic field. And watch yourself. 
The core is more heavily guarded than any other section of the big shell. You'll get nowhere just like that. So try this instead. One of the terrorists? The surveillance camera won't let you on the elevator without the right uniform. You want me to disguise myself? Men assigned to the core and those on perimeter duty are given different colors to wear. Your new outfit will work in some areas, not others. The uniform alone won't fool them either. You're talking about weapons. Right, you need an AK. But I saw them carrying an AN-94. All men assigned to the core section carry AKs. So without an AK-74U, someone will see through me really quick. You could take care of the weapon issue yourself. One other thing. There's more? You'll also have to pass a retinal scan to get into the conference hall. Biometrics. Crap. Nothing but the real thing will suffice. Deception is not an option here. I suggest you hurry. They have a nuke on their side. The nuke? They have a nuclear weapon with them? You didn't find their continuing presence here unusual? Even with the president as hostage, this is an island, and they have no visible means of escape. Even if they do have a nuke, the warhead is no good without an access code. The security lockout can't be bypassed. They don't need to. They have the code. You saw it too, I believe. The Navy man will have a handcuff. The other half of it is on the football, or the black case if you like. The nuclear button. And now they have it. Why did they have to bring the football along? To a decontamination plant of all places. But they did have to. Because, after all, the big shell is the farthest thing from a cleanup plant there is. What? Dead Cell didn't have to bring a nuke along with them. It was right here to begin with. Nothing in this affair is what it seems. A cover-up? But why? For what? For Metal Gear that is housed here. Metal Gear? The very same. My metal nuke came from the airport Shadow Moses in for me. This place is the R&D center for its newest incarnation. What the hell is going on? <laughs> Better ask games the rest. What's this for? You might be glad you have it. Keep the controller's vibration function on. What do I need a cell phone for? <gasps> Damn, did missionary just Batman us? Colonel, who is that man just now? He's not one of ours. No, we have no one like that in our unit. He said that the big shell was housing a new model of Metal Gear. First I've heard of it. Colonel, what are you not telling me? I've been completely open with you, Raiden. I've told you everything. Is that everything you know, or everything I need to know? Snap out of it, Raiden. <sighs> I'll have the Metal Gear rumor looked into. You need to make contact with this Ames. So you believe that, Ninja? Since we have no leads on the President's current location, we have no other alternatives. Right now, collect as much data as you can, including anything on Metal Gear. Are those my orders? Yes, they are. Disguise yourself as an enemy soldier and infiltrate the Shell One Corps. Understood. All right, we can put our clothes on at the speed of sound. Look at this. You want to see it? Look how cool this is. Boop. It's like I'm digivolving. All right, we gotta go to the uh, to uh. Uh, here the warehouse and go get an AKS-7U. I think it's at the bottom. Um, that's like, I don't know, dude. I have a really hard time in the sediment pool and I have a hard time in the warehouse. I think it's because like the enemies are just, there's a lot of them and they're on different floors and they, they just be, they'd be like, who's there? And stuff like they just, everybody's got borderline eagle vision. <laughs> so it just kind of throws me off. We gotta hurry up past this because the dude's gonna go up the stairs and start being nosy. See him? Go, go, go. I'm gone. I'm out of here. Oh, 
Okay. Bottom floor. Boom, boom. There we go. Looks like you've got an AK. If you wear an enemy's field outfit and carry an AK, you can pass for one of them. Listen up, kid, and don't forget this. Only the guards in Shell 1's core are armed with AK rifles. The others are armed with the AN-94, the official rifle of the Russian army. If you hope to disguise yourself as the enemy, you don't want to be carrying an AK outside of Shell 1's core. What if I carry these nuts? No, I'm kidding. Okay. I think the, the, the silencer is in here, isn't it? Boom. 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 It is not. Let's see. Let's there's somebody there. See what I'm talking about? Nosy bitch. There's a. Oh, there's the thing. How do we get there? I think we could just go under, right? Oh, no, we can't. I think we have to go through a vent in the other room. I'm gonna wait for that guy to go away. Do, 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 do. Knowing my luck, I'll run out and he'll just see me. Yeah. Boom, boom, boom. So we'll have a silencer for our pistol we're not going to use because I prefer to put them to sleep. That's my jammy jam. I don't know, man. I don't know why, but I always prefer to either just sneak by or put them to sleep. I don't like blowing their brains out. I think three is what made me not want to take out the guards because, you know, the whole sorrow part. Not because it made me feel bad, but because it just made that part longer. How would you feel if somebody put a bullet in your ass because you were doing your job? I mean, I guess their job is being bad, but whatever. Fuck it. We can put the long boy on this. Maybe we could just fuck with him, like shoot him in the leg or something, right? But Trank is just so good. Boom. Boom. Hey, dude, go fuck off. the enemy I need help uh let me look at the map fuck I went the wrong way I need to go back shit shit don't you turn around okay we still gotta be quick because that dude's gonna go up the bridge Right, what's wrong? Right, right. Okay. They got me. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> sure. Okay. I'll take my time. Fuck you, huh? Put this nosy fucker to sleep. Should just shoot that shit down. What, don't do tell on me, bitch. You know what? I got another idea. One, two, three, four, five. This is a fucking hazard. The shit. All right, it's time to blend in. Okay, hold on. I gotta take this call first. Got a minute, Jack? No! Rose? I found some information on where Solid Snake is interred. Great. Shoot. I've located the grave site. And the body? Exhumed for DNA testing. Well, do you have the results? The right arm was missing, but there was no doubt that it was him. That body belongs to Solid Snake. Hmm. So the head of the terrorist Liquid group must missing be arm an and they have the same DNA. Right. You sound disappointed. I guess. I guess I was kind of hoping to meet the legend in the flesh. I get you. But it looks like he's not behind this incident. Raiden, the president needs you, I think. 
Disguise yourself as enemy personnel and infiltrate the core section. And infiltrate. Your priority is to contact Agent Ames. Your priority is to fucking go somewhere. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right. See, like, I don't have, like... Like, I'm blending in real good. Even though I stand, stand like a rock star. What am I missing they don't have? I don't have the silencer. Other than that, it's kind of... Oh, then I don't have a radio either. Who gives a shit? Do, 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 do. Some secret in here? Okay. Oh, there's Claymore Mines in there. These like the developers like wives or daughters or some shit. Ooh, magazine. Ooh, C4. Chaff grenades. There's this one indie game that I saw recently that looks like so much fun called like Crow something. Maybe you guys heard of it? I have to Google it. What is it called? Crow something. Crow something. It's like a survival horror game, but with like Final Fantasy aesthetics, like with the way the models look. Crow something, man. I can't, I can't think of it. I guess during a cutscene, I'll Google it. Because I can't remember. I'm blending in, see? I'm blending in. I also have a pistol on my uh, on my thigh, and they don't. They do not. Dude, I think it's so cool that you can like disguise yourself. I always thought that was really cool in video games in general when you do that. That's why like Hitman is so much fun. You could just be you could be anybody. But bald. <laughs> and he never noticed. I want to be bald. Okay, where's my phone? I'm going to look up this, this video game. We have to go get the directional mic. It is called Crow something. Hold on, can you guys give me two seconds to look up this game? Hold on, okay. One. One. One, hold on, I'm almost there, I can feel it. I almost found it, it is called Crow Country. Uh, it comes out at the beginning of May, May 9th. You guys should look it up, it looks like a lot of fun. It's gonna be on Steam and PS5. That game looks like a lot of fun. I'm de There's a demo too, I haven't played it yet. I downloaded it though, I just haven't had time. Let's try the demo. Retinol pattern recognized. You are cleared to enter. Oh. That one we're gonna have to kidnap a dude. Yeah, I haven't uh, had, I haven't made time to try the demo yet because I've been playing Unicorn Overlord. I've been playing that almost, almost every night for the past like three weeks or something. I really like it quite a bit. It's pretty awesome. I would highly recommend it. I love it. I think if you bump into somebody, uh, your clothes come off that you know that's how that works more konami eyes that's definitely somebody's dev team's wife isn't it somebody somebody on a dev team's hot wife you guys doing it in the break room doing break stuff staring at the cold drinks and this guy's staring You look at the good eye on Brett right there, finding the good shit. Oh, uh, we gotta go to the B2. Oh shit, shit, shit. Okay. We gotta go to B2. So we can get uh the directional mic. So we can see that one guard that's running laps. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah, that's all I've been playing lately, guys, is uh the shit goes in. You know what's another really good song in this game? Twilight Sniping. I like this song too, but Twilight Sniping is so good. They play it during the sniping section when you're covering EE. Oh, that's that. That's that early 2000s like jungle slash like D&B. Oh man, I miss it. Like Bomberman Hero or like 
1080 snowboarding. You know what I'm talking about? If you guys were alive around that time, you know what I'm talking about. The early 2000s, like PS2 games and N64 games. I recognize her. Um, a lot of them had D&B music or like jungle. It was so good, man. So good with a TSO, like General Sal's Chicken. It was so good. Dun, dun. Dun, dun. Dun. So I want to keep these closed because if there's if you know if that guard is coming, I want to be able to get out of the way. Mm -mm -mm. I think we're full up on rations right now, right? Huh? Yeah. What does BDU stands for? Body something uniform? What does BDU stand for? I know one of you guys know. You guys know everything. But <laughs> booty disguise? <laughs> Butt dinner? Oh, this is when this dude stretches and starts doing some fucking laps. Look at that. He's about to bolt. Come on, go out to the races. Go for it. Don't you fucking walk into me. You just gonna keep stretching? That guy's supposed to start running laps. Hello? You guys walk around like NPCs. That's crazy. Penis enhancement? Penis enhancement? figure out a way to get out of this room without bumping into me. Yo, Zone of the Enders? Yo, is Zone of the Enders too good? I remember they released that collection and I bought it and I played the first game and I thought it was okay. It was cool. I didn't play the second one though. You have the I'm sure that's probably the better one, huh? According to our information, Ames has a pacemaker. This should make his cardiac pattern fairly distinct. Use the directional microphone to locate it. Okay. Hi, birdie. Hi, bird. All right, we got to figure out a way to get around these dudes without bumping into them. Good morning. Good morning. Hell yeah. Only about to start running his laps. There he goes. And he's off. He's out of here. So like, what does that mean? What are they doing here? Man, let me get out of the way. I want to do the bump into me. Can I use the directional mic to listen to them or some shit? Let me see. Fuck are you guys doing? Not working evidently. Now we wait for that one guy to come out here and then we choke him out and shove his face in that scanner. I just gotta see which direction he goes. I don't think he's gonna go all the way to the wall. I hope not. I'll lean against the wall just in case. I don't want him to bump into me. This is my, oh my God, I'm glad I did that. <laughs> he would have bumped right into me. Come here, bitch. Y'all in here, shit. Y'all didn't hear them gunshots. Retinol pattern recognized. You are cleared to enter. Oh, I shouldn't I have like my clothes on? Oops. I was about to say, if they started talking to me, would be like, yo, that's low-key kind of ghetto. Right. One of those hostages in there is Ames. The only thing we know is that Ames wears a pacemaker. His heartbeat should sound different from other people's, so use the directional microphone to locate him. Once you recognize Ames by his heartbeat, 
Keep the microphone pointed toward him, then push the action button and call out to him. If it really is Ames, he should respond in some way. What if it's the wrong person? The guards may get suspicious and try and again. come running what the instead. Fuck do you think Security could get tighter too. Try to be sure before you take the risk. Don't call out to a hostage with the action button until you're fairly sure that it's Ames. If you do make a mistake, switch the microphone for an AK and get out of there before a guard gets suspicious. If you're discovered inside, they'll cut off your retreat and call in the reinforcements. You won't make it out of the room. The mission will be over if you're discovered. Don your disguise and look for Ames while deflecting the enemy suspicion. Okay. So I'm going to give you guys a little hint on finding Ames if this is your first time playing this video game. Um, oh, I forgot to put my clothes back on. That probably would be important, right? Uh, Ames, of course, you can easily just use the directional mic to find him like you would normally do. But one thing that gives Ames away is Ames has the mullet. And that's him right there. I think he's always also in the same spot, so... That'd be cool if they swapped it. Why does that guy keep changing graphics? He's morphing. He's swapping between like low quality and high quality. That's weird. Yeah, I think it would have been nice if... Do they move Ames? I think he's always in this spot, right? That would have been cool if they kind of moved him around and changed his hair or some shit. But... Sadly, they don't. If you know where he's at, you know where he's at. They really want you to report in every 45 seconds, dude? I guess if it's that serious, they do, but like, goddamn. Report. I made a boo boo. Oh, fuck. I can't do it until he goes away. What are you looking at? Oh, wait, don't come by me. Okay. You're Ames, aren't you? Wait till he goes away. I don't want him to hear me. He's the one with the mullet. You're Ames, aren't you? Yeah, also the heartbeat kind of gives it away, but you know. I always, th I always remember the mullet. You must be Ames. Keep still and listen to me. I'm not a terrorist. I got in here using one of their uniforms. I'm taking off the tape. Stay quiet. Who, who told you about me? An informer calling himself Mr. X, dressed like a ninja. I see. Take this thing off me, will you? I'm Richard Ames. Secret Service? No, I was set in by the Lali Lule Lo, just like you. Do what? You're here to find well, out where the president is. We have little time, so I'll be brief. How about switching to nanocommunications first? Nanocommunications? Right, silence beats talk when it comes to safety. Too late for that. Are you on? Right here. Do you really know where the president is? Almost certainly. He was moved to the first floor of Shell 2's core section. The first floor? The core of Shell 2? Is he still there? I don't know. I can't get a response. You don't think he's been like the other hostages? Hmm? A hostage was killed in retaliation after the SEAL-10 disaster, remember? What are you talking about? Hmm. Regardless of what they do to other hostages, they won't touch the president. What makes you so sure? The case. You mean the nuclear button they took? Right, and the case won't do a thing by itself. That case may be the single most advanced example of a weapons failsafe system. The password is nothing less than the physiological data of the US president. Physiological data. The president's own vital signs, heartbeat, you know brainwave that? pattern, blood pressure, and so on, are constantly monitored and relayed by his internal nanomachines. 
This information, along with the DNA pattern, serve as a biometric password, unbreakable even by the latest parallel processor supercomputers. The password entry itself cannot be performed unless brainwave patterns and heartbeats fall within normal parameters, rendering chemical and other forms of coercion impractical. In other words, the login must be made of the president's own free will. As a failsafe, the input must also be reconfirmed hourly, even after the initial login. If a valid confirmation is not forthcoming, the system will automatically cancel the login. And that's why they can't harm the president. At least until the bird flies. Is there really a new model of Metal Gear here? Absolutely. The black case serves as the launch key to Metal Gear as well. Why would they hide Metal Gear in an offshore plant? Haven't they told you anything? The entire thing was planned. The oil spill, the tanker accident that caused it, everything. The big shell was built specifically for the development of a new Metal Gear model. The inspection tour was to check its progress. What's going on around here? Wait! Here comes Snake. That's him? Use the microphone to listen in. I think I'm gonna use this microphone to listen to Johnny take a dump. <laughs> King, that man is dead. It doesn't matter. Saved us the trouble of getting... <clears throat> to come all the way to New York just to get hit with a bell attack. What luck. Oh. This one's worse than that one up in Alaska. Come to think of it, that commander chick really reminds me of someone. Who is she like again? Oh. Well, yeah. She's like her. Now that's a time I'd like to forget. Ridiculous that I had to get Jack for everything that was on me. When I think about it, that's when everything started to hit the skids. It's a shame. Up to that point, I was steady cruising on the elite course. Oh, oh here we go again. Oh. Still, that Russian crew is a pretty decent bunch. The president's escort guys get on my nerves, though. Oh, whatever. For now, just gotta hang in there. Oh, oh there's no paper. Damn, Johnny. You guys remember Johnny, right? Who knows? They're a band of lunatics the, to begin the with. The guard from the first game? Nothing they do should come as a remember. surprise. I'll have his background rechecked just in case. You think he was working for them? We can't discount the possibility, especially with that intruder still at large. Yes, the man in the sneaking suit. You know more about those suits than I do. But Foxhound was disbanded four years ago, so it must be the Patriots. What about the damage to Shell 2? The circulation system for the contaminated water has been damaged. The water being drawn in is overflowing, and the lower block of the central section is flooding. Seal the connecting pathway between Shells 1 and 2. The Simtex and IR sensors are already in place. Any effect on it? No. What about the president? The password entry has already been made to the black case. In one hour, we'll need a confirmation from him. His work is done after that. Make sure you keep him alive until then. Yes, I know. What about the unit's activation? Almost complete. The code has already been entered. All we need now is for the girl to start the system. The usual method, I assume? No. The drugs took care of everything. Mm. Only a few more steps to outer heaven. Who is that cyborg ninja, Shalashaska? I cannot even guess. What about you? Olga, don't cast suspicion where it is do. Where it isn't due, when you watched my father die and did nothing. It's been two years ago, Olga. Let it go. 
I read the case file for Shadow Moses, by the way. Oh, God. How could you suspect me? How meaningful you make that sound. If Sergei were still alive... If the old man were still alive, I wouldn't need to take orders from you. Olga, Sergei was my best friend. If you sell us out, I'll kill you myself. Listen, daughter of Sergei. Don't ever let me see your gun pointed at me again. If you wish, I'll put a bullet in your back instead. You both in when no one else would. You think any government would have you as irregulars in this political climate? The worst kind of wet works, maybe. But even that's doubtful. I recommend against switching camps. You've nowhere left to go. It's happening again. This damn right arm. Liquid! It's almost as if it's having its revenge. How much do you think we spent on that arm in Lyon? The best transplant surgery team in the world. I never trust a Frenchman. <sighs> There's something going on. The incidents are becoming more frequent. Maybe that man's presence. Ocelot, I leave this place in your hands. I have the intruder to take care of. Yes, King. Is that really Solid Snake? That's what he claims. I thought Snake was dead. Solid Snake did die. But he's also here in the shell. Either he survived or there are two of them. Two of them? And that's impossible. Yeah, how the anyway, fuck does that happen? What did you manage to catch? They said password input was complete. I thought so. You said the password entry into the black case had to be made by the president willingly. That's right. So this means the president is cooperating with them. It would have to be, yes. Why? Probably tired of being a puppet. But it wasn't a smart move to betray us. A puppet? We're running out of time. They will fire a nuke. You know what you need to do before then. Fire the nuke? But it's nowhere close to the ransom deadline. Ransom? Thirty billion dollars in cash. What are you babbling about? The nuclear strike is not a threat. It's been the objective all along. They plan to slaughter millions of people. No, a high-altitude detonation. You've heard of the Compton effect? Total disruption of electronic equipment caused by EMMA pulse. Textbook answer. Well, when an average nuclear warhead goes off within the atmosphere, the result is an electromagnetic pulse of up to 50 billion megawatts. The EMMA field can reach tens of thousands of volts per meter, and most electronic equipment will be toast in an instant. If one of the key movers of world economy stops functioning, it could mean the beginning of a global depression. But that isn't their aim. What they plan to do is liberate Manhattan, pull it offline and turn it into some kind of a republic. Hence, Sons of Liberty, I suppose. Sons of Liberty? Damn, Ocelot is coming. I'm going offline. Search my pocket. Hurry. It's a security card. You'll be able to unlock doors of up to level three security. Use Hell it to yeah, get to shell three. two. Take care of the president before they launch the nuke. He's coming here. Pick up your AK. Oh, oh no! He's I gotta, coming here. Oh, I gotta pick up my you AK. Pick up your AK. I gotta do what? Oh, there we go. <laughs> Had you sweating, huh? What do you think you're doing? I asked him to remove these. I'm ill, you see. I always knew that the DIA turned out second-rate liars. What are you talking about? No need for denials. We know what you are. 
Colonel Ames. They knew that the president was planning to betray them. So they sent you in to keep tabs on him. Am I right? You. Sorry, Colonel. You failed to carry out your duties. You'll never escape the Lali Lulelo. Is that so? What the? You... You... You tricked me. I understand now. Ocelot. You... Only that a bitch. Which team are you with? Show me your face. You know who he is. No, he is not one of mine. Identify yourself. Hm. We meet at last. He's like, you ain't gonna get my other arm. Not today, sloppy second. We need the hostages alive. Hurry, get away. You, but you died. Fuck out of here. That sucks. Colonel, Ames is dead. Looked like a heart attack. Mm, that's unfortunate. However, we do at least know where the president is. So there really is a new type of Metal Gear in this place? Apparently. We're still looking into it. I've also been told that the nuclear strike was what the terrorists were after from the start. Not the 30 billion dollars. Right. It was a cover-up all along. Colonel, what are you keeping from me? I am not keeping back anything. It's not as though I'm told all the facts either. I'm pulling in all the favors I can to look into all this. Just be a little patient. Our priority should be with the president right now. We can take it that they've completed the password entry and are preparing Metal Gear for a nuclear strike. Get to the president as soon as possible. But the president is cooperating with them. According to Ames, yes. But it's also true that they're about to get rid of the president. There's something else going on here. And the president may be able to tell you what it is when you see him in person. Ah. Once they get the confirmation for nuclear launch, they'll do it. You need to rescue the president before then. Jack, I agree with the colonel. You need to protect the president for now. All right. And why don't y'all protect the goddamn president? Shit! Ah, oh, damn. We gotta escape. Bum bum. Freeze. Yeah, he even go. Ah, he was ready. I think. Uh, I don't want to deal with the camera to be honest. So I'm gonna just just take those two out. We out of here, baby. I'm oh, sure there's a camera right here. Fuck. Oh, I'm waiting. See, I wish stun grenades weren't hot ass in this game. Because why I chuck one down that hallway so quick, dude? 
I chuck one down there so fast. Dude, this camera goes so far. Dude, that camera was looking directly at my ass. And now it's easy. That's fine. It was looking at me, wasn't it? Fuck it. Bum, bum. And that is when you hit it with the old five second jab grenade. Whoop. Oh, it's something. It's, it's easy. Ain't that a bitch? Now it sees nothing. Okay, we need to go here, right? Shell 1-2 connecting bridge, I think? Yeah, because we need to get to the president because he's in... Wait, where the fuck is the president? I already forgot. Shit. Where are we going? We are going that way, right? I forgot. Are we going here? No. We are going to the connecting bridge. Here, you know what? He said save the president to Loki. I already forgot what the fucking president was. Yo, uh, Colonel? I forgot. Right. There's a gun cipher. Oh, phone. fuck me, dude. I know. Gun ciphers. You can shoot guns. I see a lot of birds over there. Tank of accident two years ago. Release crude oil. Okay. You're, you're helping wonderfully. Right, this is not good. Enemies in Shell 1 are systematically searching for you. It looks like they've tightened security considerably. Watch yourself. Get out of Shell 1. According to Ames, the president is on the first floor of Shell 2's core. Cross the connecting bridge from the okay, north side okay. of Strut That's what I thought. to get to Shell 2. That's where you need to go. That's what I thought. I knew I wasn't crazy. We need to go here. Yeah. I I don't know what I was thinking. I must be on, on Weed's Cocaines tonight. Somebody passed the, the, the cocaine. I hate cocaine. I just like the way it smells. I'm tripping. I am messing up. Oh, the evasion is still going? What the, f what the fuck was this guy doing? Get the fuck out of the way. Bum, bum. No, don't shoot at me. Let me alone. Bum, bum. Boom, boom. I think the door is on the second floor. Does that count as multiple alerts? Not like it fucking matters. Just wondering. Oh shit. That guard was acting fucking weird though, low key. Uh, we need. Oop. Over there? I'm gonna go up here. Okay. Oh, we have to go get a sniper rifle. Shit. I don't think I have one. We have to go back. Oh, fuck. I think I do need a sniper rifle. Damn, I just have to go back to the warehouse. Raiden, can you hear me? Pliskin, where have you been? Checking around. I'm in Strut H right now. How's the situation over there? We have a lead on the president's location. Where is he? Shell 2 core, the first floor. I'm cut off from the core where I am. It's a mess here. All right, I'm on my way to Shell 2 right now. There are IR sensors in place on the connecting bridge between Shells 1 and 2. If you break the beams, the Semtex will go off. Yeah, I heard them talking about that. Target the control units and destroy them. Make sure you don't shoot the Semtex. What do the control units look like? Take a look with your binoculars. Okay. 
Yeah, I, I, I don't think I, I didn't get a sniper rifle. We have to go back to the warehouse. Shit. That's the Semtex. And that must be the control unit. Just zooming in like a bubble. Yeah. We got the penicillin and the PSGM. We got to get the PSG one. All right. Okay. All right. So that at least we know. All right. Just for future me, for reference, um, we need to go back. Dude, shit. We could have just turned right right here and went straight into the Shred of Warehouse and grabbed it. But I forgot. So uh, future me, what are we doing next? We need to go back and get the PSG one from the Shred of Warehouse and make our way back here. Uh, shoot the things um, and then we uh, fight uh, the Harrier so that's what we're gonna have to do okay because uh, I like to keep these videos at about an hour and 30 minutes it's also two in the morning so that's another thing I still have to take a shower and make some tea so thank you guys for chilling with me I hope you guys are enjoying the playthrough as much as I am enjoying playing it I love this game it's one of my favorites um, yeah, if you made it this far and you, you know, listened through the whole hour and 30 minutes, thank you. Thank you for making it all the way to the end. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, please let me know. You know, when you actually let me know, I know that you enjoy the videos. You know, something as simple as I'm enjoy is uh, perfect enough for me. Let me know. Um, thank you guys for watching. I hope you all have a beautiful morning, a great day, an awesome afternoon, and an amazing night. If it is your birthday, you dastardly devil, happy birthday to you. And if it is your birthday, you gorgeous gal, happy birthday to you too. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.